Hey, this is Kevin from the Lincoln Wood Library, and today we are going to be making some marshmallow mellow catapults, or really catapults, for any kind of small, um, soft object. It's a super fun and really pretty simple project um, for kids of a lot of different ages. Um, so we are going to start off um, by going through just some of the basic kind of ingredients that we're going to use to make this. So really all it is is popsicle sticks, rubber bands, and a plastic spoon. And then, of course, marshmallows and whatever you're firing at them. So cups or targets or whatever. All right, so we're going to start off with our first step, which is building the base. And all that this requires is to use about seven popsicle sticks because you're going to want to make sure that it's high enough for the spoon, the actual catapult part, to bend back. Um, and then you're just going to use two rubber bands um, on either end just like the picture is showing, and kind of tie them off as tight as you can um, so that you have a nice, firm, and stable platform. And then our second step is going to be the base of the catapult itself. Um, so you're going to take just two popsicle sticks and just tie a rubber band around the very, very edge, and you're going to want to get pretty close to the end um, and just do it for only one of the sides, as I kind of highlighted here. All right, and then the next step, you're going to just connect the two pieces of popsicles that you've created. So you're just going to insert um, kind of the two popsicles, one below and one beneath or above the base. And then you're going to kind of tie them together, as I've highlighted here, in kind of a cross with another two rubber bands. And then the fourth and final step is a pretty simple one. You're just going to add a plastic spoon or a spoon that can easily bend. Um, and you're just going to add it to the top of the catapult base and just tie it off with either rubber bands or you could even use tape, anything to kind of securely put it on there. And you can use really however many rubber bands that you want um, just to make sure that it is secure. And you can kind of probably have to maneuver it a little bit just to get it to the point where the end of the spoon is hanging off and you can really kind of bend it down. And so now you've actually made the catapult and you can use it um, in a lot of different ways. And the reason that this is um, pretty valuable besides just being a lot of fun, which is very valuable, is that um, this is actually kind of one of the six types of simple machines. Um, so you actually kind of instilling this kind of building block of building a lever and then you're just moving this marshmallow around a pivot um, which is the popsicle sticks and um, you can actually kind of create the basics for a lot of really complicated building here um, and you can do a lot of really fun stuff with this you can measure how far your marshmallows can fly and how high it can get um, and you can kind of adjust the spoon um, and adjust the popsicle sticks and see how it changes um, how the marshmallow works. All right, enjoy.